and we're off. So we're off to Marple today. Marple is known for its 16 locks and 30 foot aqueduct. And it's 7.35, so we should be there for about half past nine. But then we're gonna stop for some sweets there. About 10 o'clock, probably. And then we'll uh, film some more when we get there. So we've arrived at Marple and we've just started our walk. Oh, the mini going by. And we're going to head towards the aqueduct, or is it viaduct? Aqua is water, so it's aqueduct. Aqueduct. Aqua, uh, aqua. And we're going. Hey. Is it? Yes, that, that way. Fox is on the lead. Lucky. Lucky's uh, Lucky. there. And we're off. We'll see you very soon. And he's having a play about with the uh, speaker system. My father was killed in action. And when my mother died, I went to live with my grandmother and husband. So we're at Brayburn's Park Iron Bridge, which is just there. And it's a listed structure of national importance as known as the only surviving cast iron bridge of its kind in the northwest. It's a lovely little location. With the river just running alongside. We're slowly making our way. The bridge was built in 1813. 1813, which you can just see on the, it's a Salford Ironworks. It's an iron bridge. So we're just working our way around towards the aqueduct and there's also a viaduct, so two together.
So we've just come up there and I don't actually think we're on a proper path. I think we've got a bit confused because now we're gonna go up there and uh, yeah, somehow up there without sort of slipping down um, and it's pretty steep and nothing to grab onto and not really a path as such. <sighs> Oh, just grab all of the tree and up we go. We're right outside of the aqueduct and viaduct, but I think we're. So, we've uh, managed to find a way out going through there and coming out of this private band. But we'll see no more about that. <laughs> On the Peak Forest Canal now. And on there. It's really, really pretty. And we're going to go back that way, just along there. But first, we're going to go along there to cross the viaduct. And there's uh, Poppy in front because we've swapped over because Poppy pulls a lot. So um, we've swapped over just from the muddy paths and I've got Lucky. There he is. Sit. There we go. Good point. So we've just got to the viaduct now. If I zoom in you'll see it says 15A. Now the A actually stands for um, meaning after, built after the canals. So we're just going to walk along here. Excuse the camera uh, shaking because look, he's sort of pulling me along. <laughs> um, and then we're just going to go up here. So you can see popping in front. Um, and that's the aqueduct. Just here. So welcome to Marple Aqueduct, built 1794 to 1800, and it's the tallest masonry arch aqueduct in the UK. And then there's the railway running right alongside. Well, it would be good if we just had a train coming across right now. So there we have it, Marple Aqueduct. So we're going to now uh, retrace our steps and we're going to go along the Peak Forest. So we're going to go up here and back up to the edge of the canal and along a little bit. <laughs> So we're now heading 
to see the Marple Lock Flight, which is just along here. Sorry about the uh, camera work, it's a uh, pops pulley. <laughs> okay, so just gonna have here along a bit and hopefully see the flight of locks. So we're at the Marple Flight of Locks. There we go, and it's absolutely beautiful. Not the weather, the location. <laughs> Weather's not too bad. So we're going to go up there now. So join us as we go right along the full flight. How beautiful it is, isn't it? Absolutely gorgeous. Serby. Look at that. They are great. So we've left the peak, uh, the peak canal, peak forest canal. Uh, we're just going over the train line, and we're heading sort of back along now, heading back towards the car, and then we're going to go move to New Mills. There's Lucky and me in the distance. 
I got pops. Pop pops. You ready? Let's go. Train! So we've just come across these uh, ruins and it's ruins of Mellow Lodge and it was where Samuel Old, no, that's how you pronounce it and what you can see in front of me sorry that's pop is the cellar kitchen, pantry and servant's sitting room so there you have it. Pops is uh, squealing because we've just got a shower and Lucky and Lee's just gone off the shower over that way somewhere. So let's go see if we can find them. Yeah? Come on then. There they are, we found them. Yeah, well I said, well I'll tell you, I'm trying to find them under there for a little bit because there's clouds coming over. Stop down. Tiny, tiny little shower, a little speck of rain, but there you go. So, the idea is it's to stop it from getting too wet. Well, it hasn't started chucking it yet, so by the time I walk on, I'm going to get soaking on it. <laughs> and my foot's all muddy, because I fell in the mud. <laughs> Look. But anyway. So now we're going to go through here, because I've just seen some uh, ruined buildings this way, or some sand first. So standing right in front of us would have been Mellow Mill in the 1800s. All around here. Let's go and have a look at this. Fire at the mill. 100 years after it was built. It was destroyed by fire in 1892. So I've left the uh, ruins and now we're just coming back up here and there's some lovely buildings. There's this like, I think it looks like a church up here. And Pops is pulling, she's there look. Keeps stopping and starting every two minutes. Just working our way back to the car. Look at that. Another building up there. Sherlock, Sherlock's barber shop. Look at the old, uh, oh, like Victorian lamps, don't they? and fish and chips.
back at the car now. That's the end of the loop. Of the Marple circular walk for about four miles. Legs are a little bit tired. Tired, you haven't done anything. <laughs> I've walked a massive loop. That's doing something. Anyway, so we've got about a two and a half hour journey home. So we couldn't do the other yeah. one, which was the other one called? New Mills. New Mills. So, so we couldn't gonna, do that one. So it's getting... It was quite... It was more muddy than uh, we expected. And, muddy. Um, sloppy muddy. Sloppy muddy. So... Yeah. So uh, that's our first ever video. Yeah. So if you like this video, give you it give a, thumbs a thumbs up. up. Um, any comments, put them in the comment section de below. Down there. That would be appreciated. This is all filmed amateurly. So hopefully... Um, it's a start and we can improve as time goes on uh, so like I said thumbs up give it a like and any support like, or like, any comments uh, put them in the comment section comments down there and even if you think we're daft just subscribe because <laughs> we'll, be, we'll, anyway. we'll be daft even more <laughs> so we'll see you on the next video so yeah. bye bye <laughs>